Out in the desolate desert south of Utah's Great Salt Lake lies a very unusual spring. This spring is geothermically active, capable of staying in the 60s even in the winter, staying within the parameters for parts of the Caribbean. This water is salty because of the Saline Lake. However, it is less salty than the Great Salt Lake, with salinity levels about equal with the ocean. This gave the owners of the spring an idea. Why not try to introduce tropical marine fish into the spring? Some people said it was impossible, as the water has many other dissolved minerals that make it quite different than ocean water. They first released a few sailfin mollies into the water. They not only survived, but bred rapidly, now found shoaling along the margins of the ponds. A few retained the dark colors of their domestic forebearers, but many, as witnessed with the introduced guppies and swordtails of Kelly Warm Springs, many reverted to their wild-type coloration. I have to say, some of these wild-type males are spectacular. But although the most common species, they are easily overshadowed by the big marine fish, such as this tang. They also have a big school of mono that swim around. They sometimes get rescued fish that outgrow home aquariums. These pork fish make a large and hungry school that will encircle a diver waiting to be fed. A couple butterfly fish also patrol the bottom. They even once had nurse sharks, jacks, and pufferfish out here. But in their absence, the big attraction are the angelfish. Two Cortez angels patrol the bottom, while a little queen can be sometimes spotted among the rocks and pipes. But the true queen of sea base is this spectacular blue angelfish with long, elegant streamers who will get right in your face. Sea base is quite a special dive site for a place like Utah and often used for certification dives. I hope you enjoyed this little dive video, and if you did, why don't you check out more of my content, including a few more dive videos I have up. Also, don't forget to subscribe, and thank you for watching.